Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. This channel, Every Data Science, is all about trying to learn various concepts of data science by practicing a lot of questions. This video is in continuation of the Advanced SQL 50 series where we are trying to solve 50 advanced SQL problems on topics like select, basic joins, basic aggregate functions, sorting and grouping, advanced select and joins, subqueries, and advanced topics like window functions and common table expressions. In this video, we are going to solve this question called Gameplay Analysis Part 2 and try to learn from it. So, yeah, let's jump right in. So, this is the 38th video of the series called Gameplay Analysis Part 2. And if I look at the companies this question has been asked in, so GSN Games, let's look at what the question has to say. We are given a table called Activate with four different columns player ID, device ID, event date, and games played. The combined columns player ID and event date is the primary key that is combination of columns with unique values of this table. This table shows the activity of the players of some games. Each row is a record of a player who logged in and played a number of games plus plus zero before logging out on some day using some device. We are asked to write a solution to report the device that is first logged in for each player. Order of the result does not matter. Okay, so let's go through this example. Here we have different records for three different player IDs, their devices, event dates and the number of games played. And for every player ID, we need to return the device on which the person first logged in. So for example, player ID 1, the first login was on 1st of March 16 on the device id 2 similarly since there is only one row for player id 2 so this is the device where the first login then for player id 3 the first login was on 2nd of march 2016 on device id 1 so 1 2 2 3 and 3 1 and that is what we have in our output so to solve this question what we can do is we can use our window functions to actually rank so for every player id order by the event date and then rank that okay this was the first login this was the second login and so on and then once we have that first logins and second logins then we can only keep those rows where the login was the first or the earliest login and what is the device id associated with that okay so what i mean by that is let's start with from the table called activity let's keep all the columns so select star and then i'm going ahead with dense rank the reason being that if on the earliest date of login the person logged in with two or more devices then both of them devices are captured in our output so dense rank over and then for every player we need to find it right so partition by player id order by the event date in ascending order asc or you cannot write it by default it's ascending order and then let's alias this as rank okay let me go ahead and run this let's see what do we get in our output so if we look at our output so let me just drag it to the left so for every player id we have okay this is the first login date so rank one then rank two similarly for two and okay well once we have this then we are only interested in the earliest logins which means rank is equal to one so this entire thing can be a subquery to create this table right so from this entire thing is a subquery to create the table which actually has the rank to know the earliest login so let me alias this as table t and then we are only interested in those rows where t dot rank is equal to one right so t dot rank is equal to one and let me just do select star okay so if we look at it so we are only interested in the earliest so for player id1 the earliest login was first of march similarly for two and three now well, once we have this then we only need the player id and the device id so we can simply go ahead and write t dot player id and t dot device id okay i think this looks good let me go ahead and run this let's see what do we get in our output so yeah this is accepted our output is same as expected output let me go ahead and submit this pass all the test cases so yeah, this is accepted and this is our it. not a very difficult question all we had to do was firstly we found out so for every player id what is the earliest login date by using the dense rank to rank and then we are only uh, interested in the earliest date so we kept rank is equal to one because that is how we ranked and then for them we just returned the player id and the device so yeah this is how we do it let me know if there is a better way or more efficient way to solve this question let the solution be in the comment section below and i'll see you guys in the next video